Guys, this is 14th video of 8057 theories. My name is Milan Shah and today's topic is T-Con register. It is one of the timer control register. It is 8 bit register. Now here as you can see the upper 4 nibbles are for timer and lower 4 nibbles are for interrupts. It is bit addressable and it is bit addressable as tcon.0 to tcon.7 so in the program you can type tcon.0 directly and assign any value 1 or 0 its byte address is 88h ok so let's start with tcon.7 as you can see it is tf1 tf1 means timer 1 overflow flag so it is basically flag bit for timer 1 now what it will do is it set when timer rolls from all 1s to 0 means basically when timer overflows it is set and it is set by hardware it is clear by hardware as processor vectors to interrupt service routine. Interrupt service routine means ISR. It simply means it is clear when processor vectors to execute interrupt service routine located at program address 001BH. So don't think much about it. It is just timer 1 overflow flag. Now TR1, TR1 means timer 1 run control bit. It is set to 1 by programmer or in program to enable timer to count. Then it is clear to 0 by program to halt timer. So it is used to enable timer. Now TF0 is same overflow flag for timer 0 and TR0 is same run control bit for timer 0 so these are similar now let's move on to TE1 TE1 is external interrupt 1 age flag it is set to 1 when high to low age signal is received on port 3.3 means port 3 and bit 3 and it is clear when processor vectors to interrupt service routine ISR at program address 0013H ok so it simply means when port 3 bit 3 receive high to low signal it is set to 1 this is for interrupt for external interrupt now IT1 means external interrupt 1 signal type control bit. It is set by program to enable external interrupt 1 to be triggered by a falling 8 signal. It is set to 0 by program to enable low level signal on external interrupt. So for low level signal set to 0 and uh, to enable external interrupt 1 set to 1 now IE0 is the same as IE1 except it is another bit means external interrupt 0 H flag and it is received on port 3.2 and its address is 0003H and now IT0 is same as IT1 the change is or the difference is it is the another means external interrupt 0 it is the another bit so 2 external interrupt H flag and 2 external interrupt signal type control bit and the upper enable 2 overflow flag and 2 run control bit so this is the TCON register and we will talk about this in program in our next videos so do like share subscribe comment 
and thanks for watching